It's a long summer in England. The T20 International Series and the One Day Series are done and dusted. It finished in a sense even Stevens three all if you look at the overall score in the One Days and the T20 Internationals. But now it's time to shed the colour. We in the studio at Cricket Buzz Live might still be in our coloured clothing, but for Team India, it's time to get into their white flannels and get set for a long five test series that's going to be something they're not always used to to look ahead to this adventure two gentlemen who have worn their white flannels with dignity for india for years and years are here with us gautam gambhir and zaheer khan i'm going to come to you gautam gambhir first never mind what's happened it's history in terms of t20s and one days very different set of uh, skills required <coughs> for a test series up against england five test matches Absolutely, and I think uh, every cricketer wants to do well in Test cricket. If you ask, and every cricketer wants to do well in England as well, and uh, it's going to be a fascinating five Test match series because you hardly get to play a five Test match series, and that also in England. I think it's going to be a great contest. Uh, India is a very good side, and probably India has got the best bowling lineup at the moment. Uh, they've had the most uh, balanced uh, bowling lineup uh, which has ever toured England. We had Zaheer Khan, who was probably the best India has ever produced, but we didn't have a backup. Uh, with Zaheer Khan, had we had a backup, probably we would have won many more series in England. We won, uh, we drew one in 2000, I think uh, six. But then uh, after that, I think had we had someone to complement Zach, we would have done really, really well. But if you see this Indian bowling attack, they've got the experience of someone like Ishan Sharma. They've got Mohammad Shami, who's proper quality. They've got Umesh Yadav, who's got pace, and then they've got Bhu uh, Bhuvi, who can swing the ball both ways as well. So I think probably this is the most balanced bowling attack. Uh, except maybe one area where India is maybe missing is a quality left arm seamer, but I think uh, this is the most balanced attack which has gone to England. Well, they're missing a quality left arm seamer because we've kept him here at Cricket Buzz Live. <laughs> now that he's finished embarrassing you, obviously bowling is so key when it comes to Test match cricket. Yes, it's a batsman's game come across formats, but Test match cricket taking 20 wickets. Well, absolutely. I think uh, in Test matches it's it's hard work uh, taking 20 wickets, but uh, that's. 20 wickets only uh, win you matches, you know. So that's that's that that's something as 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 a bowling unit uh, you uh, you have to keep reminding yourself of. So you you play a huge role. And looking at uh, the 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 processes which which Indian team has uh, has been following, which is uh, of of playing five uh, bowlers has has helped them achieve uh, success. And they have the options also, like uh, how uh, uh, Gautam was explaining that you know. You have the variety of of uh, a bowling uh, a bowling attack, uh, the bowlers which can which can bowl in, in different kind of conditions, which which adds to your uh, your percentage of of winning matches or or winning those uh, crucial number of sessions, because in in, in test matches if you have uh, the different styles of bowling, you know, in different conditions you can make use of them. Not everyone is uh, going to have success on on all the surfaces, but you know that uh, if if you can uh, if you have the bowling attack which can uh, which which can uh, which can offer you those kind of options chances of you uh, uh, doing well as a team goes higher and uh, uh, when you're uh, when you're playing in uh, in conditions uh, like like english conditions as as a, as a fast bowling unit you uh, you have to be mindful of uh, the lengths which you are bowling if you are if, if if you are bowling the lengths which 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 are uh, going to be on the shorter side it's it's just not going to help you because uh, on those kind of tracks you as a batsman you get extra time if the ball is is, is pitched short so so that's something uh, which which as a bowling unit they need to uh, need to prepare themselves uh, leading up to the test matches which they have enough time now now the the, the ODIs and and the T20s uh, are are over so that shift needs to happen uh, uh, as quickly as possible because in in shorter format of uh, of uh, cricket it's 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 usually seen that you know you get into that habit of of hitting the deck hard and at times in in english conditions that uh, that doesn't help so that's something you know these small alteration needs to happen and uh, all in all you know the depending on what kind of conditions are on offer uh, depending on uh, whether the conditions are are, are over cost or no uh, the the swing is going to be determined but uh, but yeah i mean red ball is is completely different uh, ball game and and especially the the balls which are used in uh, in english conditions the dukes ball they, it, it behaves differently to to kokobura so that's something also which uh, which which batsmen also need to be prepared and uh, and and they need to figure out uh, in consultation with uh, the the players who who have been part of uh, of, uh, of of the indian uh, indian team in uh, in the uh, in the past to to learn uh, a thing or two about how to deal with the conditions.